It's very, very hard to tell someone what is the next thing in their lives. Um, it's, um, it's a very personal choice. So my advice is whatever you do, you have to have a plan. You really have to have a vision for yourself of, of a plan forward. Whatever it is, whatever obstacle is out there, you really mustn't lose focus of, of who you are and um, your identity. Your identity is key. Sou é, um trabalhador da Sonango, bolseiro. Atualmente me encontro a fazer um mestrado em African Development. O mestrado faz parte de, 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 de um processo que teve início ano passado, em que a Sonango é, 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 teve um papel preponderante na medida em que é, é, permitiu-me estar aqui para poder então ter esse conhecimento adicional que de certa forma vai contribuir para a minha carreira profissional e para a própria é, empresa. The key to success is really that you need to be driven by excellence. You need to be driven by your passions. Well, whatever it is that you study, or whatever it is that you want to work at, it really doesn't matter. As long as you're driven by excellence and your passion, I'm sure you will succeed. A LSC é uma escola muito diversa, então aprendemos muito com, com, com outras culturas. O curso em si, African Development, tem muitos estudantes africanos. Nós organizamos o evento que tem como, como tema principal, é, pronto, falando em inglês, mas é o Built for Africa, African Solutions to African Issues. A ideia é, tendo em conta a dinâmica agora do continente, nós temos um evento em que volta é, é, para buscar soluções para a África criadas no continente. We try and invoke conversations about uh, the current African situation, what we're trying to do to solve it, how we can solve it, why, why is it important, who needs to be involved. So we try and get as many influential people in one room as possible. We have different frameworks, we have different legal frameworks, we have different political systems, we have different um, economic policies. What for me is really important as Africans, what are the similar challenges we have and what are the lessons that we could share with each other and to improve from each other. In a way, not only try and benchmark uh, Europe or uh, America as our references, but also to look at our own examples, things that we have done well in the continent and use those as, um, as part of our solutions. A engenheira Isabel dos Santos, que é uma pessoa de, 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 de grande impacto no continente, líder de negócios, é conhecida, e então foi uma sugestão minha para que ela viesse então também é, é, compartilhar as suas experiências e, e, e trazer a sua visão sobre o que é que ela espera, o que é que ela vê como é, muito negócios em África. We wanted to have uh, Miss Isabel dos Santos here um, because she's clearly an influential woman. She can give us insights into how her company her country and also her personal experience can contribute uh, to the development of the African continent. A lot of people are excited to hear um, what she has to say um, on you know, her views and so on. People hear a lot about her, but it's very rare that they get a chance to be in a room you know, with someone like her. Where I feel that we have to have a plan and we have to have a vision for the future and this must, must really start now. The next growth in our, is in Africa. The next growth is, is not in another continent. We are the fastest growing middle class economy in the world right now. Estou totalmente uh, ansioso por terminar o curso, voltar para para Angola, voltar para San Angola e, e, e dar o meu contributo. So what's the next big thing? I think that the next big thing is definitely, I mean, the thing that you guys are probably going to be building. Um, I think it's going to be about energy. We still have a big energy deficit in the continent and energy is key and why? It's a major input for industry. If energy is too expensive, we cannot be competitive. We need to have cheaper, better, more reliable sources of energy and those take massive investments um, and it also takes individuals to go out there and get them done. So I'm happy to see that a few of you in the next few years will become energy champions in Africa. <laughs>